Well, hundreds of people on bikes had Atlanta drivers seen red. They blocked traffic, went through red lights, and caused other roadway headaches. Well, tonight, Jamie Kennedy talked to the group to figure out what exactly is going on. He joins us now live from Midtown with more. Jamie. Thomas, the ride starts here in Woodrove Park behind me on the last Friday of each month. Now, those involved want the public to know they never intend to cause traffic headaches. The evening, around 300 riders gathered to enjoy a leisurely ride through the city. A number of those riders caused traffic headaches, riding through red lights and stopping traffic. We all come together and people that want to ride with their kids, with their dogs, with their family, with friends, uh, with anybody that they really want to come out. The ride is run by the riding collective Critical Mass, which has a monthly riding event. But Friday's behaviour in the city by some of the riders has angered commuters. We don't know if 50 people are going to show up to this thing at every last Friday of the month, or is it going to be 300, 400 people? That's kind of hard to control. And really be mindful of those laws and regulations. We shared the footage with the Atlanta Police Department, who sent a statement reading, we observed a number of traffic violations and unsafe practices, including the blocking of traffic by non-law enforcement officers. Oh, Critical mass riders aim to bring awareness to those not using vehicles as transport and say they want to show respectful behavior. Don't do something you wouldn't do in a car. Has it happened before? Um, possibly so, you know, and, and it's not something that we're proud of. Now, after bringing the violations to the attention of those involved and the APD, they said they are willing to work with city officials to make sure the next ride is smoother and safer and hope that drivers will do the same in return. In Atlanta, Jamie Kennedy, CBS 46 News.